Hello guys, uh, this is Mstar183 and I'm going to be talking about the Up Mini Plus um, and one of the biggest design flaws that I found out. So pretty much the way this works, this is the printer head, it's pretty much hold together. Um, you got to take this apart right here, this little cable off, then you take this off. Pretty much the, what keeps this printer head in two place are these little trick magnets right here, right? So the problem is that this printer head is not really metal. It's aluminum or some kind of material that is not, uh, is not, uh, is not magnetic. Uh, so the way that they fix this, this is my old printer head, right? As you can see by how messed up it got. Pretty much uh, this is the new, the new printer head I got sent, shipped by them. The way that they fix that problem is they crazy glue this little piece of metal right here with crazy glue onto the head to make it magnetic when you put it into place. This will prevent pretty much when you're printing, you want to have a steady print. You want to have enough pressure to keep it into the, the printed material into place, right? If you have a wobbly head, you know, going to get a lot of messed up prints. So that's why they put that little piece of metal there. The thing that they don't tell you about is that that little piece of metal with the crazy glue, when it gets really hot, and after a couple of uses, the piece of metal is going to come off. So pretty much one time, uh, after trying a million things to ha how to fix my print, after I wasted pounds and pounds of material on messed up prints, I don't know if you can see this one because this is black. But this is this got really messed up. This one was almost done. It got messed up. This one got got pretty much halfway. Like it got done, but it was like no hold together because there was not enough pressure. This one got almost done, but as you can see, not enough pressure doesn't keep the material stuck together. This one right here is supposed to be. This is my. I, I tried to print this print like four times. This one, as you can see, messed up print. Messed up print. Uh, I don't even know what that is. I think this was supposed to be a part of a of a tree or some. I don't know what it was. Anyways, messed up prints. These are the ones that I, I was able to find in my garbage can because I saved my material for recycling and stuff like that. So, if you have a messed up, uh, if you don't have enough pressure, then your prints are gonna get messed up. I couldn't find that in the forums. I couldn't find that in the in the customer service. So I learned the hard way. So pretty much, uh, when I was trying to do all that stuff, my print, my printer head got messed off. Like pretty much, there's times that I would come home to a big blob of material, and my printer head just chilling on the side, like on the floor, right here. Or uh, I'm pretty sure, like whenever you get a a material that comes back and is sticking up, it got cut up to this part right here, and it broke up a piece right here. That is hold, that's supposed to be holding the LED light. That's this printer here, right here. You see, that's the way it's supposed to be. And also, if your thing gets clogged enough, this is another design flaw that I got. If your printer gets clogged, you have to take this apart, right, guys? When you take this apart, if you take it apart enough times, these little screws will start losing thread on this little um, uh, motor right here. So as you can tell, I'm already like made, I already dig, dig holes to make, to try to get as much stress that I can. But uh, that's another design flow. So this is already not very stable as it is. Another design flow that I found out is that this little cable came came loose at one time. So my, my, uh, my fan wasn't working. It wasn't cooling the print down. And that's one of the reasons my printer wasn't working correctly. So you got to make sure that both uh, things are welded together. I weld it back together. So pretty much that's uh, that's my review of the uh, Up Mini. And um, I hope that helps a lot of people that are having problems with the printer right now.